Hello gamers of all kinds, this is Brecht and welcome back to more Black Dream. This is, we're looking into one of Mishiro's memories, which was when she was in elementary school, I guess. So, yeah, here we go. Listen, we aren't you coming too? We're gonna explore the ghost lake. You're such a fad father, Kachan. It's just a rumor, okay? Same as the school's seven mysteries. That's not true. They found a body there last year, remember? And last week they found another. Which means the demon of the ghost lake is making people throw themselves in. That's just coincidence. It's a pretty deep lake, so everybody just picks it to off themselves. Okay. No, that's not it. They say that the body they found last week died like exactly one year after the one from last year. Which means one year later, at the same time, the same place, somebody's gonna die again. And both victims were students from the same middle school. For real? It was on the news. You can't call that a coincidence. Yeah, it is a little strange that someone from the same school would die exactly a year later. The ghost lake wants sacrifices. It's gotta be an evil ghost using black magic. We should exterminate it. Alright, I guess it's worth checking out, but... Feels more like a plot than a ghost. But I'll go. Alright, Teruhiko, let's get going. Okay. Usui, come to the station later. You seem like you'd like this stuff. Hey there. Boys aren't in that kind of thing, huh? It's kind of scary to think people are dying on the same day each year. I don't want to get into anything weird. And if it's just kids going, our parents will get mad. See you, Mashiro. You should go home quick and not get involved with that stuff. Okay, the oh, fucking chair's in the way. And there's a little boy over here. What are you doing here all by yourself? Huh? Where'd my pen get to? Maybe I lost him when we played hide and seek. Ah, uh, so you're trying to look for your pen, huh? Uh, library books, but that's it. How about in here? Same thing, library books. Well then, how about in here? Uh, lots of brooms, but nothing else. Well then. Maybe it's in this? Ah! I found your pen, little boy! Here you go. Here's your pen. Oh, my pen. Where did you find it, Mishiro? Under teacher's desk. Oh, okay. I hid there for hide and seek, so... Anyway, thanks for finding it. I'm gonna go home now. See you tomorrow. Alright, later, man. Okay, Mishiro, you know what to do. Kill yourself somehow. What what, what can we use to kill ourselves in this room? Maybe jump off the te teacher's neck and break our neck? No? That doesn't work? Okay, maybe I'll hit ourselves with the... Ch no, it doesn't work. I won't open. Well then. And won't open. Maybe slam this shelf down on yourself? No, nothing. Maybe there's something in here that you can drink and kill yourself with. No? Hmm. Oh, right there. Break the broom. And then use the spiky part to stab yourself. <sighs> okay. Maybe the window. Oh. Okay, sure. Why not? Yeah, sure. Why not? Ah, God, my legs! I didn't die. My legs and arms are just broken. <laughs> oh, that would suck if that if that happened. <sighs> okay, we did it. We did it. Nishiro came too, again standing before the mirror, though she still felt a strong pain and her vision blurring. There wasn't even a bruise on her. Yes, there were rumors about the ghost lake back then. That was that, that was probably where the Mirror Lake rumor started. But ultimately, after the second death, there were no more incidents involving Mirror Lake. Elementary school. I seem to recall that was a pretty fun time. Uh, elementary sucked for me, actually. <laughs> Just in Mishiva gained a piece of yes, something lost important, blah blah blah. I'm gonna save, but yep. And then, ah, we got a gold key. You know what that means. We can open the gold doors now. Uh, save, I guess. Bibbidi boop bloop. Okay. We haven't been finding their memory. We, we haven't been finding these guys' mirrors lately. I'm starting. Time to get a little bit 
suspicious as to why we aren't finding their mirrors that much anymore. I mean, we found Yuzu's, one of Yuzu's before, so you know. Uh, let's go in this door first, though. We'll go in the other one later. Hey, cool! Night helmets! Can I take one and wear it? That'd be- Okay, never mind then. They broke. Don't see how that's possible. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. Let's see. There's an unnatural gap in the books. Okay, so we need to find a book. Hello there, Mr. Knight! The stone statue quietly looms. Well, that's cool, I guess. Don't know why you're quietly looming. Respect your predices. I don't know what that means. Oh. Well then. Okay then. I'm a bit confused. That's not a good sound. That... The, okay, I'm out. I I don't know if that's how. Is that how the music is? Cause that's pretty ominous. Oh fuck, she's in here. She's in there. She's in there. Why is she always around? Ah, oh, the room is too dark. We need a stronger lantern. Okay, well, you know what? Just, just for the hell of it, I'm gonna go into the other room over here. Cause I'm suspicious. Hey, this is a lot nicer. Welcome, master, to the realm of blood. We shall guide you to the mirror quickly and without interruption. What does that mean? What does that mean, huh? Why'd you call me master? Okay. Well, anyway. Oh, look at these presents! I wonder why they're there. Okay, uh... If you are tired, enjoy a soothing meal. That sounds absolutely nice. Why? Well, let's go do that, Mishiro. A great power of fish fruit. Okay, we can't we can't sit there. Hey, cool, there's a door over here. Why did I do that? Something bad is gonna happen. Something bad is gonna happen. I'm just expecting something gonna run. And it's unending. Hello? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay then. Whoa. F fuck. What? Are you kidding me? So if I go off, what? If I go off the normal path and something like that? Okay, well, fuck you. Hey, look, it's a pretty... Wait, what does that sign say? If you see anything you like, relax at your leisure. Okay, well that sounds nice. Pretty white dress. A piano, but Michiro can't play because I don't know why. Ah. Oh. A lot of its ages uh, blah 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 blah. Okay. Not sure what's going on here, but um... Teddy bear! Hi there! How you doing? What does the sign say? If you wish, you may take a comforting rest. The mirror is to your left. Are you sure about that? Are you sure you're not just trying to trick me? Huh? You're trying to trick me, aren't you? Alright, but you know, I'm a really curious idiot, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a... Oh, no, can't. Okay, well then. So the mirror, are you sure the mirror is over here, hmm? Are you sure? I feel like you're tricking me. I feel like this is a trick. The mirror shows butt. But what? But what? Why? Why you do the butt? She has a bad feeling unlike any before. This is a bad decision. Two years ago! 
She has a bad feeling. Oh man. Hey Asui, you're late. Because I had gem. I don't care, just give us your homework. You did do it, didn't you? Can't get in the mood for three math worksheets. Thanks, Lil Asui. A thousand yen fee for every wrong answer. You're rich, so that's enough responsibility, eh? What am I doing? I'm living like a slave to the every whim of these pieces of garbage. You listening, Usui? Always spacing out. That's blank stares, Usui, alright. Does the class even know you're a student? If you don't stand out some, nobody's gonna notice ya. I've been dealing with them for about three months. They're just letting out stress for the coming exams. They're not going to get a de they're not going to a decent high school anyway. That's the sort of thing I think about as I let it wash over me and endure. With the recent death of my grandpa, a famous artist, the Sui family has been in turmoil over his inheritance. So I can't talk to my parents or stop attending school. At home, I care for my family. At school, for these losers. I feel myself withering, lonely and doubting. What am I living for? Don't say that! I'm the one who's building up loads. Ugh, goddamn. Okay. I'm the one who's building up loads of stress, not you jerks. Say, did you know? I do. Contrary to appearances, she really likes frilly outfits. Huh? For real? Totally, like Gothic Lolita and stuff. She's gone out like that on her days off. Now that's something. So cute, Usui. You want to be a princess? Don't talk about people's tastes like that, you fuckers. Oh, whoa! 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 Mashiro! Uh, I mean, that's pretty badass of you, but... Damn! Well, it's about time, Usui. Show us your cute little clothes, Usui. Let us snap some pics. Don't rob me of the one thing free of stress. Don't get into my private life outside of school. You listening? Bring out your favorite clothes, Sunday or something. We'll have a fashion show. What do you know, Asui? Always such a dim, awkward girl. But today you'll get to be a pretty frilly princess. Oh, so adorable for her age. <laughs> Don't make me any more angry. Hmm? You say something? What, Asui? You got a complaint? Hey, shut your trap, guys. So he wants to say something. Hmm? It. Off. Not good. I can't tell my emotions are getting uncontrollable. If I stay silent, they'll get bored eventually. This isn't wise. So please, don't reach for my pocket. Don't grab what's in there. If I grab that, it'll turn the world upside down. What is it, a knife? What's that? Say it loud and clear, cutie pie usui. Knock it off, you f***ers! Oh, whoa, whoa, so- mm. uh. Yes, in that moment, Mishiru Usui took out a small hidden knife and swung it at the delinquent. It left a trail of red on the girl's hand, six centimeters long. Immediately after this incident, a teacher heard a scream and came running. It wasn't a severe wound, so it didn't affect my school record. Oh. Sorry, Mishiro. Go ahead. Read it. It wasn't a severe wound, so it didn't affect my school record such that I couldn't graduate. And the delinquents no longer approached me. In fact, no one in my class did. Oh, man. That's... That's pretty much... That's pretty fucked up. And when my parents heard of the incident, my mother especially lost it and berated me. She began using harsh discipline and control over me in the name of correction. That was this memory. Now to just break the mirror. Guys, this is screwed. This is fucked up. Whoa, shit. Whoa, shit! That's just... 
Well then. Well then. That was a nice fucking memory. On the next part. What? I can't help but feeling that was a bad decision.